And in this video, I'm going to be talking about top five survival apps that every prepper or survivalist should have on their phone. So first off, these aren't all the survival apps. There are many more good survival apps out there, but I picked these because I think if you're only going to buy five apps, then you should buy these five. Also, they are these, all of them are free, but you could upgrade to like more of an advanced version to either get rid of ads or get more information, but all of these are free. So first off, a lot of preppers or survivalists, they don't really use their phone to their advantage, a lot of them. It's starting to become more of a, I guess like more of like a um, thing that like happens more, that a lot more preppers are using their phones and devices. But we shouldn't rely on these apps, but we should use them to our advantage if we have them, and either if we have power or we have extra power. So the first one, also, all of these apps may not be on Android. So the first one is the Compass app. This is on all iPhones, but if you want, you could pick, like, choose a different Compass app. Okay, so that's the Compass. It's pretty simple. It shows your elevation. It also does show your location, so that's why I'm not going to open it. Or at least, like, show it to you because I don't want you to see my location. So the second one is the SAA, SAS survival guide so there's a paper copy i have that one but this one the one i downloaded for the app is the light so it has less information but you could download the pro for i think six dollars but it's pretty basic so you load into the app and you could click on essentials and you have an intro you have a bunch of bunch of different stuff that you could read about and then you could also take a test so you could test your knowledge which I think that's a really cool thing so the third app is the Red Cross first aid app so this is one of my favorite apps because first off learn you could learn anything you could read through articles and then there's a prepare section so like yeah so the first article is National Preparedness Month and there's a bunch of disasters that you could prepare for and then the middle one is emergency so if somebody does have a life-threatening event you don't really have to search through it. you just click this all the life-threatening events show, events show up and then non-life-threatening so you would just have to click on it so let's say hyperthermia and you, it will show you the steps and then you just have to click a button to call 911 you can get quiz quizzes they offer and then hospital you could just put in your location or if you allow it you could just press use my current location and they will find you a hospital, which during a grid up situation, that I think is really good. So number four is scanner radio. So it's this app that scans with your phone so you could see local like radio signals or just popular ones. So I guess they like record it and then they stream it on this app. So you do need wi Wi-Fi and like internet connection. That's the only bad part. But if you don't have a radio or if you're interested in getting in radio, then you could do this. So, see, look. Um, wait. Let's play. Um, yeah, okay. But see, look, there's popular ones. There's all of them. You could sort by area. And then if you do let it use your location, then you could search by nearby. So that is really cool. If the grid is up and you just want to... I think it's really cool because you could go through the local like fire department, local police department. I think that's really cool. So number five is I track a light. So this is a tracking app. So you could understand like paw prints and like footprints and all that stuff. This is the light you could upgrade to like a pro. I think it's $5, but see look, American Badger, you could see the, see the tracks. So, so hope you enjoyed that really quick video guys. Please smash that like button and subscribe to Happy Prepper. Share our videos so we can grow. I would highly recommend to check out all these apps. All of them are free. You can upgrade, but still, I'm also not sponsored by any of these apps and I will not receive any commission. So I just really think that they're really cool apps. Also, we are so close to 6,000 subscribers. It's, it's crazy, really. So Happy Prepper app.